So what are some of the key aspects of service assurance and maybe talk a little bit about where performance management fits into the suite of service assurance products? Yeah. So service assurance is a broader term that, as the name suggests, is used to help assure the service itself. Now service can be many different things. Service could be just a connectivity service, a VPN service, a mobile data service, private APN, it, any, it can be any kind of service. Now to assure a service, there are a few different things. One is the service available. That's a traditionally a fault management aspect. You know, the router is down, the switch is up, you know, interface is flapping. Is, the, is my service up and available? Not about the quality, but just the availability. That's a very traditional fault management uh, silo, if you will, which is part of the service assurance family. The second one is, how is my service performing? It may be up, but I'm not getting the 42 megabits per second that I was promised in the LTE. This is all about you know, the throughput, the latency, and the jitter, and those kind of things. You know, how is the quality of your service? So that's really part of the performance management. So that's what we InfoVista do. Then to assure the service, also there is things that the tools, the tools required by the operational people. And this is like probes, you know. If you say I'm not able to connect to the, to the network, I'm not able to make a call or download the data, somebody has to go into the details of that. And probing technology is often used to go into the detail step by step on the, each step on how a call should normally should have been connected and why it is not working. So that troubleshooting part is done usually by the probe systems. And then performance management, where does it fit in? So performance management, uh, like, uh, so performance management is, uh, so you, you can edit it. Well, yeah. no, we don't edit them up.